Yeah, hi everyone. I'll try to be fast to tell about the second version of the QualiMapa tool for high throughput sequencing um, uh, quality control. Uh, so basically, um, as you know, high throughput sequencing becoming more and more important during past years now. This is like a basic uh, thing for every um, molecular biology experiment and uh, there are a lot of uh, methods which are allowed to analyze this kind of data. However, however, there are um, some platform-specific protocol-based and analysis errors, such as, for example, PCR problems, duplicates, uh, algorithm-induced biases, and they have to be taken into account. And luckily, there are special tools which perform this quality control for all the data. For example, FastQC, some tools, Picard, RCQC, and the tool QualiMap. So basically, QualiMap um, is a special application which allows us to analyze BAM files, alignment data, uh, and to detect if there are any problems related to coverage analysis, uh, insert size, and many, many more. So basically, in input, there is a BAM file, there is a notation file, and output is in HTML format um, or PDF format, and uh, also simple text format that can be reused in further analysis. And there were three analysis models, BAMQC, or NACQC, and GANQC. And today I'm going to talk about the second version where the BAMQC mode was improved significantly. There was a novel mode added called multi-sample BAMQC. And additionally, the RNA sequencing uh, quality control analysis was redesigned. So let's start with the improvements in BAMQC, which is um, the analysis of BAM files, such as, for example, alignment type, coverage analysis, inter-site duplication rate. There are many issues um, improved there, including, for example, additional metrics for each parameters, out-of-region analysis, uh, duplicate uh, alignments uh, exclusions and many many more of them which there will be not enough space to put it here but what is happening now that uh, sequencing experiments there have now a lot of samples if like three years or four years ago it was only two or three experiments now it's hundred BAM files available and that's why there was a novel method introduced which is called multiple BAMQC analysis it allows to first of all compare all the samples BAMQC results of all the samples together uh, such as, for example, coverage, GC content, inter-site. This is first of all to see this comparison. And second thing, there is also PCA analysis, which allows to, de uh, to detect if there are some outliers in the uh, performed experiment. So um, this is the novel mode in BAMQC, but additionally, the RNA sequencing um, data analysis was also redesigned. Uh, previously, the BAMQC mode was uh, um, similar to such methods as, for example, RCQC, there was a transcript coverage analysis, GC bias, 5 prime, 3 prime bias, counts analysis, but now it is redesigned to support a multiple um, uh, samples and um, to compare them. For example, such things as expression level, gene types, and again, this is also important when there are experiments including several samples and in, even in different conditions. So this is almost everything, but the most important thing that I would like to mention that QualiMap becoming uh, more and more open source. Of course, there is source code repository, there is discussion forum, the number of downloads increasing significantly. But what I would like to mention after release of the second version, the user activity increased a lot. There were uh, bug reports, there were um, non, um, novel suggestions, even there are now bug fixes from users and I wanted to put everyone, of course, to this slide, uh, to, uh, but there are not enough space to put all the names. So um, I just want to thank all the people who were participating in this and continue participating. And all the supporters are mentioned in commits, news, and in history log. So uh, this is it. Uh, thanks a lot for the attention. And uh, there is a reference. And did bucket and if any questions, then I will be next to the poster and I will be happy to answer them. Thanks. <laughs>